quarter way into the match, he started to lose it, and then halfway into the match, he didn't realize whether or not he could win or not. And not only until now, I think, is he, that he has, does he have that feeling again. Really, really undecided on what to do. We would like to see him win this match. That's because we don't like Schmidt, but we want to see Siegel go on, and, you know, because he brings us a lot of entertainment. Well, it's not that we don't like the young <laughs> We don't know him. <laughs> Oh, my. Well, he's going to have to shoot the combination. Yep, on the nine, Mr. So Shea. Therefore, the suspense is definitely still there. Let's uh, find out what happens. Do you think there's any adrenaline out there right now? I mean, is it, is it, is, is it flowing? Now, is he going to follow this softly <laughs> and shoot play the four over here, or is he going to draw a little bit? This is a, see the thing about hitting these here. If you hit them soft, you're going to make them all. But if you hit them very hard, you better hit them clean. Yeah, clean. But I, I think he would like to get back for the eight. Yeah, I, well, I agree. He is going to have to come back for the eight. Oh my! See he, that? He, uh oh! Uh oh! Uh oh! What was well, see? Well, you know that was unexpected. And now twelve in the side. It looks like he's going to have to revise his game plan somewhat here. Let's see how that 12 laying in the side. Mm -mm. And now he's got to do something he didn't want to do. But of course, uh, he's, he's no, he, can he bank the one? I don't think he has enough room to bank the one. I don't think he can hit enough of the one to bank it cross corner. And he's ended up in a really an awkward position. And what about the 12 in the corner down there? Unfortunately, uh, there's it's, something down in that corner over there off the deuce, ain't there, the 12 ball? He's looking to play the 4 8 combination. Now, this is the type of a shot that he would pocket with regularity five years ago, but today, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know where the 4 was going. I knew where it was going when you drew it. Notice the last time he took so much time, he was really undecided on whether to play that combination 7-12, and he missed it by a half a diamond. Once again, you know, he's really undecided on what to do, and he's forcing himself to shoot this shot. I don't know. This is a very difficult shot, especially. Uh, well, I'll tell you what. Look at the cue ball. Oh, my. Oh. Well, that was really. Did he break his stick? That was really, uh, yeah, you know. Uh, Did he broke his stick? I don't know if he fell on it in the pressure of the weight that he uh, broke it, or else he just. You know, he's really beside himself right now. It so. was accidental. It was accidental. He he kind of went like he was going to butt it, and then what happened, he well, went to hold it, hold it, and he I think his weight fell against the joint, and it broke off at the joint. He well, didn't break his make, cue, make, it broke his shaft. What to make matters worse, it's, it's the stick that he made. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right, let's take a look at the score and exactly what the score is and... Uh, what chances Siegel has of making another appearance, if uh, if it's possible? What is the score of the match right now? Okay. We'll get it up there on the monitor. No, I believe that was an accident there, folks. Okay, Siegel has 132 balls. He needs 18. John Schmidt needs 22 balls.